Hello and welcome, I am Patch with your Game Clown once again, and we are going to be continuing with Plague Inc. Evolved, the custom scenarios. Now, one thing I actually realized is we're in the middle of our Halloween extravaganza. So, what I'd love to do is actually find a couple more of these that are sort of Halloween themed. Of course, there's the vampire one, which I don't want to do. Um, but let's see. Ooh, human hives. That seems pretty terrifying, actually. But let's see if there's anything else real quick. Uh, the demon awakens. Ooh. Let's subscribe to that real quick, and let's see what else we've got real quick before the sea plague, furry virus, uh, Markiplier virus, Bernie fandom, to Cure, chickens, hack division, demon possession, red weed. Hmm. Is there a search function? Because that would be really handy. Mm, second dimension. Alright, let's do a quick search here. <gasps> I have no mouth and I must scream. Now, this is discouraging right here. Maybe I'm the only one who's actually ever played this damn thing, but, uh, Borg, 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 Shrekkoning, Freedom, Space Virus, Ebola, Jerk Facism, Ugh. Vampire. I'm going to have to check some of these out later on. Subscribe to that. I'm going to have to check some of these out later on. Uh, but I think we'll just continue with the... Oops. Um, what the hell? Let's just do Vampire Plague and uh, see what we do with that. Alright. Play. Do we do... Do we up both the ray? Okay, so. Alright. Vampire Plague. Okay, so looks like we're stuck with a virus, so that's a thing. Um, let's do Catalyst Switch. Last time we didn't really have much luck with that. So we're going to keep with that, since vampires will do air, because why not? Rural file, they're probably better with... Uh, Probably herbophile since, uh, you know, cities and blah. And bonus, yeah, let's just do that. I don't know if it's going to do that, right? Dark guard, that's stupid. Uh, so. Boom. Dargard virus, Dawn Guard virus is an unknown pathogen which the ability to infect the brain and muscle cells. How will it respond in a human body? Oh, you win, you have to kill everyone or turn everyone into vampires. Your choice, remember, it's the vampire gain the abilities of other humans to try to attack. So, ah. so, what a surprise. It's in northern, uh, it's in Europe, Central Europe. Bop, bop. Okay, so no book review this time, guys. I actually haven't seen and or watched any of the um, uh, Twilight books. Actually, you know what? Um, I am going to do a book review. <laughs> um, also dealing with vampires. Um, let me see here. Handshake. Well, of course, blood. What, what, why, why would you even not have blood? Um, so, what is this? The virus does everything it can to prevent that the vampire body dies. The brain can be broken, but the heart will always beat. Dead vampires remain infectious. Uh, let's see here vampire denticulation. Uh, enamel in teeth causing bigger, harder, sharper teeth. 
bloody taste. Virus infects the neurons in the tongue, causing iron to taste in the mouth. Iron like taste in the mouth. Night vision. Vampire metabolism. And. Cold surfaces. Yeah, we're gonna do that because. Okay. So anyway, um, you may have seen, if you've been watching my back behind the scenes series, I've been doing, uh, I've been reading up on some Lindsay Sands books called the, um, the Arjunu series. And essentially it is a, that one is a straight up romance series about, uh, Atlantean vampires. Um, mm -hmm. And so Canada is now American. Inevitable. But essentially, um, the, the, the series that I was reading was the uh, Rogue Hunter series. Blood 2, uh, four regions in nutrition. Let's do... What's this? Night Stalkers makes the virus able to infect beta bats, wolves, and other night creatures, slightly increase mutation chance. Let's go with just spreading it out. Since it's a virus, it'll sp um, what is this? Vomiting and fever. Since it's a uh, virus, it'll ooh. ooh um, but that I think eleven. I think is what we're gonna do next. But anyway, um, any of the Arjunu series involves Atlantean vampires. So it's not quite the same as this. They they won't turn into bats. But the the the, the basics of the stories are is all of the <laughs> all of the uh, the vampires were actually created by use of nanos, bio nanos in Atlantis before the fall of Atlantis. So, the oldest of the characters, uh, some of, them, of which you actually do get to see in the series, are literally, like, thousands and thousands of years old. Thank you. And... The, um... The, the thing is, is that with... Can we devolve? But it's a virus, it's probably going to cost devolution. De 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 devolution. Uh, yeah, it's going to cost instead of. Pathogens, causes and control of fatal tumors. We don't, we don't want to go that route, devolve one, yeah. We seem to be getting, like, lots of... Um, lots and lots and lots of points on this. They're being very generous with the points. Um, but anyway, the, the, the what happens in the Twi uh, sorry, the Archnew series is that um, a lot of the vampires, they're thousands of years old, and many of the characters that you, uh, you deal with are like hundreds of years old. And they have a set of uh, rules where they can only turn one person in their lifetime, which they usually use reserve for a life mate. And now what a life mate is, is since the, uh, the nanos, in order to make them better hunters, they gave them the ability to control people's minds, which means they can actually read other people, uh, even during, um, fornication, let's say. So, essentially what that means is that it becomes very difficult for them to... Um, be around people because you can hear their thoughts, you control people during sex, and so a life mate is the one person that they, they find that they cannot control, they can't, you know, read their thoughts, so they don't have to be on guard all the time, and, you know, they can just be themselves, and for some reason the nanos sort of put people together where they're, like, the best match for them. I don't know, you know, nobody knows exactly why it works that way, but it, in each one of the books, no matter what series you're uh, reading or what family member, because it usually deals with the Arjunu family and the uh, off brands of, whoa, there's America. <coughs> 
and uh, you know basically those select characters um, I mean it's a huge massive family which you'd expect when most of the members have been alive for a thousand years um, god damn it um, there's Central America and there's Russia and I believe India so yeah we are spreading quite quickly here um let's do more water so we can get to the islands and um let me see here uh so yeah no i mean there's 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 a whole lot of books in this series and if my explanation of what is actually going on in all of it isn't all that great, or if you, you missed part of it with watching all this garbage, um, aka my playing, not the game. The game is, of course, awesome, otherwise I wouldn't continue to be playing it. Um, I mean, don't worry, because uh, every single time uh, a new book is going through, um, I sh uh, Lindsay Sands actually does um, explain the entire thing all over again for new readers, so it's very it's a, it's a very easy series to uh, pick up, and um, a lot of the a lot of them are really emotional. Now the cool thing about the series is that not every book is is the same exact. Did we already get like vampire metabolism? So, let me see here. Bloodlust. Let's just hold off on that for right now. Alright. Oh, look at that. Bats. Bats are susceptible to infection. Cockroaches. I know some people love the hell out of that. Um. And wolves. The wolves. What music they make. So, yeah, and like I said, that is thank you very much, Greenland. Um, it is very much a, a romance series. Um, you know, there's always like the comedic, yes, the comedic, uh, hey, we're, we're about to bang for the first time, let's get interrupted, and um, so there is definitely a lot of that, a lot of that, but... The, um, there is also, like, I want to say every, ooh, lots of cockroaches. Cockroachios. Cockroachia. Um, yeah, basically, um, oops, every single... Yeah, it's like every, uh, uh, let's say every two, so every one out of four books, four or three books, is like, it's not just a like, hey, it's a romantic comedy, look at all this wacky stuff that we're doing, oh, we're so cute together. Um, there is um, actually some kind of, let's do Bloodlust, and then anemia and vampire insanity causes the host to think about drinking blood combined with the hunger of metabolism makes the blood the liquid ideal I, I, I makes the blood the ideal liquid to get glucose but otherwise won't uh, otherwise harmless hold on get rid of your shit um hold on confirm fever we don't want it. We don't want fatal. So devolve. Yeah. Like I said, they're 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 basically throwing. Um. They're basically throwing DNA at us. So. Okay. Nothing's gotten shut down yet. So there's that. So. Oh, hold on. Um, we can do that in just a moment. 
since we don't actually have any... Oh, here we go. Vampire Insanity. Yum! Let's see. Keterin overproduction takes the neurons, uh, causing razor sharp claws, which are more dense, and adrenaline surge, virus increases the amount of adrenaline, which is uh, released on the host. Vampires are harder, lot harder to kill by mortals. Okay. I guess if they're actually vampires now, perhaps. No! Thank you. Come on, Madagascar. Give in to my love. So yeah, no, it's it's like yes, thank you, Madagascar. Um So it is definitely a series that I I actually own most of the books. Um and actually, um, Love Bites, which is actually a good one to start with, is actually the first of the book series that I ended up purchasing. Thank you. We'll devolve the vomiting. We don't want anything to prevent us from... Cucarachas, come on! Oh. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. And, um... Now we're actually biting people, we can do that, and then, uh, one of these guys, so let's actually take a look, ooh, 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 ooh. let's take a look at, whoop, okay, hold on, whoa, hold on, hold on, world, let me see, Morocco and Botswana, so all land, land masses, so that's good. Um, so yeah, if you're into that sort of thing, or even if you're not, um, I, I'd say check it out. It's definitely worth a read, and like I said, each, um, nice, each one of the books does explain the whole Nanos thing, so there's definitely that. And then, what's this? Complete Vampire Regression, the virus... Resets the neurons where the memories were stored now takes place for instinct and sensory vampires are now the ultimate predators. Um, hell to the fuck yeah, we're gonna do that. Um, so that's 39, not 37. Okay, that makes sense. Thank you. Oops. Yeah, they, they are just throwing, throwing these at us. <laughs> Children of the night. What some humans can make. Okay. Yeah. And no, we're gonna just go bat form. Actually, maybe they maybe they combined to form something. Are they gonna turn into zombies? Cause that would be kind of cool. Mutated and develop vomiting symptom without using DNA points. Why? Why the vomiting? Stop mutating vomiting, you stupid bastards. You're vampires. You don't want to get rid of all that precious lifeblood from all the vomiting that you are doing. Bleah. Bleah. I want to suck your Excuse me. Vomiting vampires. That would be terrifying. Anyway, Lindsay Sands, Arjunu series. Uh, read it. I enjoy it. You're welcome. Another book review. Why do I keep doing this? Maybe I should have done um, Janine Frost's uh, Cat series. That was good. That's pretty good, too. Maybe later. Maybe later. <laughs> so anyway, um, this one, this one actually seems pretty speedy. I, I don't know how I feel about this one. This one, granted, it's like I, I'm not as big into vampires as most people. Maybe that's the reason why I'm kind of on the fence about this one. My thing is, is that with the werewolf one, it was a, it was actually a challenge. Um, Inflammation symptom. Why are you inflaming? Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
This ad, that's inflammatory information, you sons of bitches. Um. Uh, whoa, 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 what is this shit? Kidney failure. Stop fucking trying to kill people. Tumors, go the fuck away. There's already enough fucking problems. I don't want to kill people, I want to eat people with their, with the... Uh, let's see here, so... Everything is infected. What's not infected? Let's try to find the, the countries that are still... Thank you, stop that shit. New Zealand, are you the ones that were trying to... Uh-huh, uh yeah. The last healthy person on the planet became infected with the Twilight Sucks virus. Okay. As it should be. The cure to... Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I can't tell if this means that people are... De yeah, that's dead. Tumor symptom. So how do we... How do we win this? The, oh, here we go. Vampires rule. The Dawn Guard virus successfully turned all humans into vampires. Homo sapiens are no more vampires, however, have no consciousness left and, uh, and relentlessly fight each other for the ultimate rush for blood. Actually, that's a pretty good um, like little thing here with the, the vampire fang and the, the eyeball and all that stuff. Alright, so I guess we won. Um, cure progression, 80 vents, <laughs> Hmm. Okay, my final thoughts on the Vampire Plague. Um, with the Lycanthropy, um, it was actually a challenge. I mean, both of these, I mean, Day of the Trifids, I, uh, uh, I actually just enjoyed the hell out of it. But the Vampire Plague, I gotta say, guys, I, I, I'm, not a, I'm not actually a fan of this one. Uh, if, if I were to have my my final thoughts on this, I mean, I wasn't even paying attention for the most of it, but it's just like, just throwing DNA at me. I, it, it, this probably was one of my shortest episodes just because I had everything that I needed. It's I wasn't like struggling to get that next symptom to, it's like, oh god, don't kill me, bro, anything like that. I mean, if I wanted to, instead of um, devolving all that stuff, I could have just thrown in a couple of the... Uh, you know, make it harder to cure things, and I would have been, like, just coasting by, no problem. Um, interesting concept with the way they, they did that, and turning everybody into vampires is cool. And, you know, the way... I, I, but I'll be honest with you guys, I'm going to actually, I'm going to thumb down this one just because... Most of these, most of these have actually been just... They've been a challenge. They've, they've just been... Like, how am I going to complete this? I mean, the, the way I... F okay, the way I feel about this one is I would have had to struggle really hard to have lost this one. And if... If, if there's absolutely no way to lose, it's not really so much of a game as it is just a, hey, look at this movie, only instead of being right there in the thick of all these vampires taking over the world, you're actually seeing it from, you know, a world, you know, world perspective. So, I don't know. I'll, I'll take a look at some of these others, uh, but I think just for this one, yeah, the, the Vampire Plague, not, I'm just not impressed with. I mean... If it was if it was more of a challenge, this this would have been a good one. But it's just like, just essentially vomiting uh, DNA points at me, and it was just it wasn't even like it's like oh god, what do I spend on this now? I didn't have to I didn't have to micromanage anything. I was just like I'll just get this, I'll get this, I'll get this, I'll get this. I I shouldn't be I shouldn't be able to buy like three things at a time. So yeah, that's that's my thoughts on the on the subject. But uh, if this is your th you know into your thing. You go ahead and check it out for yourself, guys, uh, and uh, thanks for joining me. Uh, hopefully you'll join me for the next one, and until then, cheers, all.